Hello everybody, my name is Aki. Today I'm gonna show you how to create beautiful style lapses with the Insta360 One RS One N360 Edition. My basic camera setting for style lapse is style lapse mode, JPEG plus RAW, ISO 800 to 1600, white balance 40 to 4500, shutter speed 30 seconds. Since the Earth rotates 15 degrees per hour, it takes two to three hours of continuous shooting to capture the dynamic movement of the stars. Unexpected strong winds might occur during the shooting, so it's advisable to use a sturdy tripod. Based on my experience, you will need an external battery for shooting longer than 3 hours. Unlike DSLR or mirrorless cameras, there is no need to adjust the focus as it's set to infinity by default. The dual lenses will capture everything in the sky, so you don't need to worry about the framing either. Waiting for a few hours in the middle of the night can be tough. Be sure to bring along some entertainment or sleeping essentials to turn the challenge into a joyful experience. Once the shooting is done, the app automatically creates a style lapse review with the JPEG images. It's already looking great, but to get the best image quality, we're gonna have to edit the raw images. This is how raw 360 images look straight out of camera without any image stitching. Import the raw images into Insta360 Studio PC. Select them all and click the export button at the bottom right. Make sure that 360 photo is selected. Now the stitchings are done. Let's categorize the images in Lightroom. Since we are working with the raw images, there is much more flexibility in adjusting the colors and exposure to your preference. Once you're done categorizing, synchronize the setting with the rest of the images. Then export the pictures and open up Premiere Pro. When importing the categorized pictures, select the youngest number file, click option, and image sequence. This way, all the pictures will be imported chronologically. Drag the file to the timeline, and now you got a 6K360 style lapse video. Before editing further, I always render the 360 video in ProRes so that in the future I can further edit the original file without losing any image quality. Okay, it's time to reframe the footage. There are basically two ways to do so. One is to use Premiere Pro plugin. Search and download FX Reframe on the internet and drag it onto the footage. By tweaking the parameters here, you can pan, tilt, rotate, zoom in and out. If Premiere Pro runs too slow in the process, use Insta360 Studio instead. Personally, I find it easier and faster. My favorite movement for star lapse is Earth Rotation. By setting keyframes to keep the position of the stars unchanged, you can create the illusion of the Earth rotating around the stars. Another interesting effect is Tiny Planet. Click the keyframe and select the planet icon. By clicking on the image and dragging it to one direction, you can create a unique perspective like this. By the way, you might be wondering how I created the Star Trial time lapse like this. It's super simple, go back to Insta360 mobile app and open up the Star Lapse preview. Tap the small toggle right here and wait a little while for the AI to process the images. And that's it. This function is only available for Star Lapse mode on the mobile app, and you cannot do this after deleting the original JPEG files, so please be extra careful. If you like this tutorial, be sure to hit the like button and try shooting yourself. I'm looking forward to seeing your results. Have a nice shooting.